Chapter 98 Self Indulgence of Sinners Sin Originated by Man All Sin Recorded in Heaven Woes for the Sinners Chapter 98 And now I swear unto you, to the wise and to the foolish, for you shall have manifold experiences on the earth. For ye men shall put on more adornments than a woman, and colored garments more than a virgin, in royalty, and in grandeur, and in power, and in silver, and in gold, and in purple, and in splendor, and in food, they shall be poured out as water. Therefore they shall be wanting in doctrine and wisdom, and they shall perish thereby together with their possessions, and with all their glory, and their splendor, and in shame, and in slaughter, and in great destitution. Their spirits shall be cast into the furnace of fire. I have sworn unto you, ye sinners, as a mountain has not become a slave, and a hill does not become the handmaid of a woman, even so sin has not been sent upon the earth, but man of himself has created it, and under a great curse shall they fall who commit it. And barrenness has not been given to the woman, but on account of the deeds of her own hands she dies without children. I have sworn unto you, ye sinners, by the Holy Great One, that all your evil deeds are revealed in the heavens, and that none of your deeds of oppression are covered and hidden. And do not think in your spirit, nor say in your heart, that you do not know, and that you do not see that every sin is every day recorded in heaven in the presence of the Most High. From henceforth ye know that all your oppression wherewith ye oppress is written down every day till the day of your judgment. Woe to you, ye fools, for through your folly shall ye perish, and ye transgress against the wise, and so good hap shall not be your portion. And now know ye that ye are prepared for the day of destruction. Wherefore do not hope to live, ye sinners, but ye shall depart and die, for ye know no ransom. For ye are prepared for the day of the great judgment, for the day of tribulation and great shame for your spirits. Woe to you, ye obstinate of heart, who work wickedness and eat blood. Whence have ye good things to eat and to drink and to be filled? From all the good things which the Lord the Most High has placed in abundance on the earth. Therefore ye shall have no peace. Woe to you who love the deeds of unrighteousness. Wherefore do ye hope for good hap unto yourselves? Know that ye shall be delivered into the hands of the righteous, and they shall cut off your necks and slay you, and have no mercy upon you. Woe to you who rejoice in the tribulation of the righteous, for no grave shall be dug for you. Woe to you who set at naught the words of the righteous, for ye shall have no hope of life. Woe to you who write down lying and godless words, for they write down their lies that men may hear them and act godlessly towards their neighbor. Therefore they shall have no peace but die a sudden death.